Hey y'all. Okay, guess what I just did? I just got something from Starbucks delivery. Yay. Okay. My order. I mean, let's, let's, let's go over this order. And then I'm going to eat my breakfast because I haven't slept. Now, this is the first time I've ever ordered Starbucks. So, I ordered a few things to get me through a few days because you know ah, I don't know all right so I first remember I told y'all I wanted to buy this um sweetened iced coffee so I got that um they wrote on the front of it but I ordered this so this is good sweetened iced coffee I think I did it like I think I did good I think I made it very simple right okay and then this is smaller but this is 12 packets 12 packets this is six packets so this is the iced coffee here and then this is the 12 packets of instant coffee so i'm gonna give that a try one is just add ice and the other one i don't know it's my first time all right then i ordered ordered a hot coffee I ordered my Fenty Caramel Macchiato extra hot um, no foam it tastes like it that means just throw it in the microwave you know? so how come we was fighting why were you fighting me You must have knew. You must have knew if you were the best this up. Okay. And then I have, I asked them to put this on. I think I was very direct. Like, if you messed this order up, you would just be in so much trouble. You know? I asked them for exactly that. The only thing they might not have is the ice. I won't be mad at them about that. Because I have ice. Um, so basically, I ordered the hot coffee and I ordered the cold coffee. I do have the straws, so I can at least taste test. And the caramel's at the bottom. It should be exactly the same way, except it's a cold version. They was not playing. <laughs> they got the cold. It was like, listen, don't mess up her order, okay? Don't mess up her order. <laughs> don't mess up her order, okay? All right, and then I wanted breakfast because really I'm... I'm just in the house and I haven't really left and I'm like not really feeling good. I always get the headaches and everything. But I got a little bit of croissant. Got a little croissant. Croissant. And then I got, this is what I really wanted to eat. The bacon, egg, and cheese. Um, um, I'll, I'll look on my, my receipt. This is what I want to eat right now. So this is good. Okay, this. You can have coffee. This in the freezer. Maybe it can last me for about three or four days, you know? Then I ordered a bagel. I, I like cinnamon raisin. Um, it's crazy because normally I would get plain. But I don't know what it is about me and cinnamon raisin and cream cheese. So I did cream cheese bagel. And this is hot still. And I asked them for the cream cheese. And I got the butter for the croissant. And this is good. And this is my... for a blueberry muffin that I normally get toasted and it's hot and I have a toaster so mm -hmm. I think my order is good I mean it was really a simple order you know so, I'm proud of y'all um thank you okay y'all can go on the website 
um i think this was like seven and some change this is like 12 and some change um this is like the muffin i'll go over the prices okay because i did spend money but it might last me for a few days they said spend the money we gotta spend the money so let's spend it all right so i got the let me see go on to my order it got here 10 minutes early because it was supposed to get here at 3 30 i ordered it i was trying to put my order together a few times and i kept on getting knocked out of the system and i had to keep on re-putting the order and re-putting the order in and re-putting it in but then i finally put it in then i was good and then um but how do you place the order you go on to the actual website for starbucks and then when you get there you scroll down i didn't even get to use none of my points i didn't get to use any of the coupons or anything i just paid the price and you know i just want to hurry up and get back to work so you know i can finish all of this and i could just go ahead and get back to my regular life but um i bought the coffees and stuff because i'm having problems with my coffee like it's like the coffee i've been drinking is it's not something's i don't know maybe i'm expecting the flavor to be quicker than what it is and or maybe it's just flat or maybe i just have a taste for starbucks i've been wearing starbucks since i think a thursday i forget i think it wasn't that last thursday it was a thursday that just passed so i've been wanting starbucks but what you do is you go onto the website you click on order i'm about to go right live right back down because i still have a headache i just wanted to eat something here this coffee i might do i don't know what i'm gonna do hot or cold but I, i'm missing ice that's the only thing i'm missing but i asked for no ice inside but i did put a note that said ice so if they would just remember that for next time, that would be great. Um, I know I put that. All right. So basically, I don't remember how I got to the order, but you basically do go on to the website. Um, you click on order now. And then just to get an idea of the order. I don't know if they have what I just ordered. That would have been great. Let me see if it's in my order history. Because I'll save that as one of my favorites. And then whenever I run out, I'll get that like whenever I need it. Um, as y'all know, I love me some Starbucks. Okay. So, yes. The order was for... saying prices i don't know why but i just do but, but my phone is frozen help me that's why i don't want to say it because i'm trying to have my address but i was trying to just let y'all read the order was 70 dollars and 18 cents but it's gonna last me i think for mm, a day or two depending on how much i drink that coffee Depending on how much I drink, that's two coffees. It's already about 3.30. So I might drink this coffee. Then this one. Then. I might. No, I need it because I have these for tomorrow. So I bought, I bought with the intentions of not having to worry for a few days, you know? So... When I run out, um, I be drinking coffee though. I don't know how to make these, so I'm gonna try to follow the directions to a T. And if y'all wanna see me put these together, you can let me know. But I basically got um, 19 coffees here 5, 12, 19 instant coffees. Um, and that's already more than what I be getting. When I be purchasing my big coffees 17 there my big one here my other one here and four one two three four meals about four four breakfasts mind you um i don't know i could have soup tonight i could make the soup i bought i bought soup but the refrigerator is is acting funny so i have to make sure that i'm gonna have something to eat you know because the temperature on the refrigerator is not acting right. So, um, I 
was trying to tell y'all the prices, but it's not popping up. Let me see. I'll try one more time because something is it is off, but I don't know why. I was trying to cover my address. And I know y'all want to come home with me anyway, but I'm just saying. Like, I'm trying to find my order. Like the, the actual price list. So maybe I would have to click on each one. I'm trying to wrap this up. Work with me here. Work with me. Okay, cinnamon raisin bagel. It just won't show me the prices. It, each, it's like 345, 345, 345. This, this, this instant coffees is like um my my coffees are like 655 each. I had to pay 60 cents per sugar. So had I not bought, I paid like 480. For my liquid sugars so if y'all sell liquid sugar i can put that on the website and then i can buy the liquid sugar on the website um if y'all have that i'll buy that so i'm sitting here wondering how am i gonna get the flavoring like is the cork is the milk in already included in these that would be so smart these companies are so smart man they're so smart I don't, the only way that I could figure out how to do this for y'all to get y'all the prices, I'm going to just try to go back through the search and do that, okay? So that you have an idea. I don't have a receipt. I don't have a receipt. So, the caramel macchiato, when you click on it, um, it's already $5.25, right? It's already five twenty five. Five twenty five. Um, when you add onto the order, you make it a venti that then it adds a dollar and thirty cents to it, and then you add when you customize it. You click on customize the item, and then once you customize it, then you can scroll down. In my screen and my phone, these are like two non-compatible things, but I can show you. Okay, because my address is not there, but you scroll down and then you click on classic and then it charges you like what, 60 cents per. So I got the classic. It comes with vanilla syrup already, but I like the classic so I don't have to add no sugar. It's already included and this classic is like flavoring. So I add eight. So eight times sixty is four eighty. So I paid six fifty five plus one two three four five six seven eight. And I'm hoping that's not gonna. Be, I paid eleven thirty five per coffee. Why? Because one, those are my coffees. Two, they're already pre made. Three, they're right. If this is something that I didn't even think was gonna happen. So, I mean, I could trust them now. You know, I thought I was bugging out. And I never do be, but I thought I was just bugging out. <laughs> okay, so, and then I like, I don't know why I said ristretto, but I put ristretto. Ristretto is like when they, like, steam the coffee a little, a little bit more. Like, they double steam it. That makes it a little bit more robust, and it makes the sweeter flavoring effect occur. So that. And then the caramel drizzle. It comes with caramel drizzle. I didn't want the whipped cream. I don't like the whipped cream because when you put the whipped cream in these type of beverages, like it's just, it's not like a, a hot chocolate where you can just heat it up and it makes it like that kind of flavor. It's more of a, it's more of a, um, what am I talking about? <laughs> the, the, the whipped cream. These are not whipped cream kind of coffees. They are, it will make the coffee actually go sour quicker. So I like my coffees without the whipped cream. So that's why, as long as you kind of like follow what's on here, that's pretty much it, you know? Um, what else? Let me see. And it's good to get it with no ice because you can add ice as necessary. You can put it in the freezer. It's still going to be cold. It's still going to have the flavor. If you have the ice in it, by the time you get it, it might be watered down. It might not be what you want. So... That's why I got it separately, the ice. And then, of course, temperature, you get it. I actually think I asked for it to be, oh, no, you asked for it to be extra hot. 
and then the foam I take off the foam because I don't like the foam and it's still gonna be 11:35. camera I need you I need you hello help a sister so yes okay that would be the venti for the um, that's the venti hot one if I'm gonna do the venti cold one that's in another list so let's go to cold drinks next time I think I'm gonna try their matcha I'm interested in the matcha I tried it with some um, Dunkin Donuts before their matcha was good which kind of gave a green light for everybody else to try their matchas so I'm interested I will try it I'm, I'm more of a um, macchiato kind of person okay um, cold coffees and we're looking at the Venti Caramel Macchiato. Hold on one second. Um, I'm trying to drink something because I'm kind of, I want to make this hotter because it's, it's hot, but it's like, it's doing enough for me. Like, you know how you have the headache and all you want is that coffee? You need that coffee. You want that coffee. You know, it's not strong, it's not nasty, it's not, you know what I'm saying? It's not killing my vibe, it's like, where have you been? Kind of type of flavor, you know? Okay, um, let me see. Oh, I'm here's this is I'm, I'm passing this the, the coffee thing, but let me go back. I'm trying to. I don't know how I passed it, but I'm assuming that it's about the same price. Um, I'm assuming it's the same price. Ice Cafe Mocha. Okay, here it is. Ice Caramel Macchiato. So, let's say, for example, I put my same thing in. Venti Caramel Macchiato. Um, let me see. I put a classic... This one is eleven forty-five with the classic, and then I think that's all I put. And then the ristretto, and the two percent milk is what comes with it. The ice, I wish I could have got that on the side because you know it's just kind of cool. It would have just been cool. But um, yeah, I'm not I'm not mad about anything. Throw my coffee in the microwave for about 20, 30 seconds. Little heat up, I'll be all right. Um, you know, heat up your coffee in increments of 20 seconds to 30 seconds, 20 seconds, and then if you need 20 more seconds, do 20 more seconds. Seriously, because like, you get into burning your coffee and then you're wasting your money. Um, okay, so that, and then let me see. I'm trying to hurry because I don't want my camera to get say something. Hold on one second. I'm looking for. I really got knocked out of the order. <laughs> I'm actually looking at each individual order, if that makes sense. Hold on. I have to start over. Because for some odd reason, it's like, it's saying it's Uber Eats with them. Because when I go on Uber Eats, I don't see the order. Like, this one is like, this is deep. Okay, this is, this is deep. Okay, I didn't get to use the $5 off coupon for my first two orders. But I'm going to give you a promo code so you can get $20 off your next order, Okay. Unless you already have benefited from it, but um, shipping, like when they bring it to you, is supposed to be free. I think I paid 99 cents, or it was probably free, but I gave the delivery guy a tip, and then I also gave them a tip on the thing, because, you know, it, it said it had, I had to give them like 50%, so it, was like, it looked like they got paid, <laughs> it looked like they got paid $20, but it's okay, because I got, really I got what I wanted. It'd be different if I didn't get what I wanted. But I'm not mad. Right now, I'm not mad. All them other times, 
every all them other times I was mad this is the only time I'm not mad okay that's important because you know they wasn't giving me stuff so um now I'm up to I mean without a fight now it's not a fight okay so then I got the double smoked bacon cheddar I'm sorry y'all I'm left handed that I got that double smoked bacon cheddar and egg sandwich it's $5.95 $5.95 okay so if I find out about that liquid sugar and y'all sell it y'all put it on here I'll buy that cause I'm gonna need that so I can like ahradinera like you know, I need to save some money. All right, so that. I didn't get the cookie. I did get the croissant. The croissant is $3.45. A lot of the things I got, no, not the chocolate croissant. Careful. I like how I click on it and it just, bam. Yeah. And that is $3.45. Okay. And then I got the... What else did I get? I got the blueberry muffin. Blueberry muffin. That's $3.45, okay? I like this one. They cut it in half, and they toast it, and they put butter. Well, I put butter. They used to put butter at some point a long time ago. I don't know. I remember one time, but I put butter on mine. So they toast it, and then I put butter. So good. That's my thing. And then, um, I think that's it, right? Bagel. They didn't have the plain bagel. So I got the raisin bagel. Oh, wait, no. Now there's a plain bagel, but it wasn't there when I wanted it. But it's all right, because I like cinnamon raisin bagel. As long as it's not a plain bagel. Um, or I'll, you know, you know how you have to have substitutes? It's a substitute, but it's just, it's just, it's really good. So I got that with cream cheese. And it, to me, is just more of like a classy, it's more of like a, um, like an etiquette. You have to have etiquette to eat something like cinnamon and raisin with a bagel with cream cheese. I don't know. I don't know. Because if it was a plain bagel, it'd be like, okay, I can get a plain bagel from anywhere, you know? Like, I know you know what I'm saying. So, y'all, that's the video. Let's look at this. Oh, look. That's why it's so small. Cool. It's instant coffee. Oh my God, from Starbucks. Oh my goodness, yay. Okay, it says, pour into a cup, add eight fluid ounces, hot water, stir, and enjoy. So I have to add milk, right? I got some um, carnation kind of, you know, with the condensed milk. I got condensed milk. Hopefully that'll work in the meantime because I ain't got no um, milk. I got I got creamer. I got, I got powder creamer. I got milk. I got milk. I'm converting everything to powdered if I can. Shoot. Powdered milk, powdered tea, powdered coffee, powdered sugar, powdered everything. You know? Because stuff is going bad. You gotta watch videos on YouTube so you can, like, learn how to, like, conserve your money. This is the cold one. I feel so special. Oh, my God. Combined with 16 fluid ounces cold water, stir, and add ice. Yeah. Y'all. Gotta put more in this box. That's all I got to say. Because this only got Cinco. And I know it's made, but. This is only for five days. This is five times. But I'm not gonna drink five cold coffees. I'll probably drink three cold coffees. I probably won't drink five. But if I can learn how to use this one, I can add cold. Maybe I can add ice to this. Because I tried to add ice to my coffee the other day and that did not work. 
didn't. Normally it would, but it just hasn't been. And it's probably because I didn't add no, no, no um, cork, like chocolate. But it's okay. I wanted to try this. I'm glad I did. I'm happy about the purchase. It's a nice investment. It's a nice start to a beautiful friendship. A very beautiful relationship, right? Okay. So, y'all, I'm getting ready to get out of here. If you need me, you know where I'm going to be. Make sure you come back and see me. Until next time, that's a wrap cut. Um, yeah. Like, share, subscribe. Ring the bell for notifications. Oh, let me give you a code or something. Let me help you save some money. Um, okay, hold on. Really quickly, there's a couple of codes. There's one code. You can get $5 off your first two Starbucks orders with promo code SBXNEW. Looks like this. Okay. SBXNEW is actually right on the homepage. Okay. And then on the actual Uber website, it's interesting how they was right around my, oh, my, right around my area, right? You know, kind of, kind of happy now. It was like, come to me. <laughs> All right. So then I have, let me see, orders, favorites, wallet. No. Okay. We go to the actual. I can give them five stars. Yeah, yeah, everything is good, but y'all ain't get, oh, no, no, they, when y'all start asking for extra, like, just get the five stars, you know, take the five stars and run with them, y'all start asking about what's good, what's bad, what's this, what's that, I'm like, oh, man, I don't want to answer that, peace, <laughs> he answering all those extra questions, just take the five and go away, go away, all right, let me see, so, that was one, at the bottom, right? I mean, of course, everybody has this probably. But at the bottom, see that little thing right here? Right there. It says, eats to new something, something. And because I don't know what it says, I'm just, it's this one right here. But it says copy, right? You can get $20 off your order, okay? It says basically the it's eats dash T N Y eighty six X X M U E. Okay, that's the code. Eats dash T N Y eighty six two X's M U E. Okay. One more time for you. Okay, and it should be on the bottom of your Uber thing code right at the bottom of your uber order thing it's right here at the bottom okay and that's it you'll get twenty dollars off your order and it says seven dollars seven you get seven dollars off of their they get seven dollars off their order i would get twenty dollars off you get seven dollars off but if you purchase you can get twenty dollars or something when you promote it to somebody you don't have to promote it, but if you want $20 on your on your order, you'll be all right. Okay? That's what it is. I don't know. Try that code. And the other code is $10. So you got $10 plus $7. That's $17 plus... Um, don't they give you like a little $3? Some type of... You get free delivery. So, I mean, y'all, there's, there's discounts. That's already a little bit more than $20. So... I hope that you enjoyed it, okay? If you need me, you know where I'm going to be. Make sure you come back and see me. And until next time, that's a wrap. Cut. Go get y'all some Starbucks, okay? All right. Or whatever you want to eat, okay? Thanks for coming. Bye.